Hi guys, for today's vlog, I'm going to roast a chicken. Marinating is very important in roasting, so it's up to you how many hours you're going to marinate it. Prefer overnight because it makes more tastier to your food. If you are in a hurry, you can marinate it for 6 hours or it's up to you guys. Oh, my oven is not functioning. Where do I roast my chicken now? And if I'm going to fry it, it's not a roasted chicken anymore? What shall I do? I need to find a solution. Oh, at last, I found this. But the question is, can I finish cooking in this pot? <laughs> no, 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 no. Hello everyone, I'm Savannah and welcome back to my channel. This is my first time of roasting a chicken and I'm excited. And since it is frozen, we need it to soak for an hour at least in water. Waiting, you can also prepare the vegetables that you are going to use in this recipe in order to save time. You have to make use of the time since roasting is a long way of process of cooking. And here are the vegetables that I'm going to use. This vegetables is very important, especially the lemongrass. Don't forget the lemongrass. This is the number one ingredient when you are roasting. If you have this, the aroma of the food will make more tastier. I prefer if I have martyr and pestle to make my work faster. Look, it will turn faster into pieces. Now let's start marinating. First, I add ginger and then followed by garlic and lemon grass chopped. And the next is the onions and the ground black pepper and also one teaspoon of salt only and one tablespoon of lemon and one pack of mamacitas barbecue mix this is good for one kilogram marinade and then I also add one pack of oyster sauce this is a small pack only and then you have to mix it well so that all the ingredients will incorporate it and after you have to add one and one half cup of 7-up and then you have to mix it well and then you have to place the whole chicken into the marinade you have to massage it for five minutes and put some stuffings inside from the marinade then you have to cover it and marinate it in the fridge overnight or up to six hours it's up to you if you are in a hurry and after marinating we will start the stuffing procedure now these ingredients are very important in stuffing and please don't forget lemongrass it's the most important of all then add one tablespoon of salt and some garlic seasoning and after you have to mix it well again now we will start the stuffing procedure just follow what i did and now is my taglish version <laughs> Ngayon, maglagay tayo ng tatlong cubes ng butter inside. Sabi nila may magic daw yung butter pag inalalagay mo sa lechon mo. Kaya nga, ano, pinafollow ko na lang po kung anong ginagawa nila. <laughs> and it's exciting also if we do something different. Sabi nila, pampalis daw ito ng amoy na manok. Di itry natin, wala namang mawawala. At saka, huwag niyong kalimutan itali ang paan ng manok para hindi lalabas yung stuffings natin. Ngayon, tutusukin natin ng isang barbecue stick. Ito po ay ating holder mamaya. Pag-checkin natin kung luto na ba siya. But before that, you have to rub it first with an orange. This is for an additional taste also. Isa din po ito sa mga sikretong ingredient na ginagamit nila. Improvise din ako ng uupoan ng manok para hindi rin madapa. <laughs> now let's start cooking Mangkawali po itong nilalagyan ko ng charcoal Wala akong nilalagay na apoy dyan sa loob ng flower pot Pag maglagay kayo ng apoy sa loob ng flower pot There's plenty of smoke Talagang magagalit ang yung kapitbahay pag gawin nyo yan Pero pag ang amoy lang ng niluluto mo ang pumapasok sa kanilang bahay Hindi sila magagalit Hahanapin pa nga nila at amoy-amoyin kung saan ito nanggaling. 
it's perfectly cooked as you can see because maliit lang po ang yung manok na ginagamit ko hindi siya masyado malaki kasi maliit lang po ang flower pot and now it's food tasting time oh it's very juicy as you can see tikman nga natin mainit na mainit siya oh it's juicy it's really juicy look guys hindi ako nagsisinungaling ha talagang juicy na juicy ito tikman ko oh ang sarap totoo nga ang kasabihan pag may tiyaga may makakain if you learn how to cook there is no need for you to go outside and buy because this is my first time and I made it flower pot cooking is very useful especially when you go to a certain place when there is no oven available huwag kayong mag-alala guys pag may apoy talagang maluluto kung ano ang niluluto nyo because at first I'm also confusing if maluluto ba yung manok ko o hindi kasi pag hindi Pre-pritohin ko na lang. Iiba na rin ang title ng vlog ko. Maging pritong lechon na. Oh, this is very delicious. Kaina na! Hope you like and enjoy my vlog. Just keep on watching. And please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching!